Little pig. Oh. oh, listen what song we're playing. How perfect. Hello. Christy's here from the Wildlife World Zoo Aquarium and Safari Park, and she brought some baby warthogs. Yes, I did. These are little warthogs. We're, do, we're playing a Hakuna Matata. Oh, they are. Cute. I have to say they're really cute. They are. They're so precious. These guys are so fun. Now, these are females. This is Wilma and Betty. Oh, <laughs> They're really Betty, playful. They like to jump Where's and spin. Fred and Barney? <laughs> and it's really adorable. Well, the males actually can grow to be over 300 pounds. Oh, my gosh. Wow. That's yeah. a big uh, pig. Yeah, the females are only going to get about 100 oh. to 150, so they're quite a bit smaller. Mm -hmm. They're very playful and active this they morning. Like you. Whoa. Yeah. Hey, wow. Hey, easy. <laughs> they do. Betty, it's so funny. They have completely <laughs> different personalities. Hey, Betty. Baby gets so excited and will leap yeah, and do Betty little spins through the air. You can see she's Betty wagging Betty. her little tail. Betty, Betty, Betty knows she's on TV. Yeah, <laughs> ready for her close up. And uh, Wilma's a lot more low key. She's a little oh, bit older. Oh, Betty oh, actually is the more dominant female though. Really? Oh, yeah. Because of because so, she's high energy. Yeah, yeah. She she is very we, high energy. We were talking well, off camera. <laughs> They're part of the like pig family. <laughs> they are so. This is a wild member of the pig family. Now this is the only species that can actually go several months without actually drinking water. Hmm. Which several is several months. Yeah. Oh how is that? They're going to get the water they need from the foods that they eat, and that's very important. A very important adaptation because these guys live in the Sahara Desert where there's not always a lot of water available. Oh, so they know how to be resourceful. <laughs> they so do. you said from the foods they eat, which we have a big cup of uh, fruit here, they which is full of water, so this right? Is, yeah, grapes are their favorite treat. We'll see. Uh, oh, they eat. also like are technology. They eating, like, are they eating? <laughs> they're eating here. <laughs> hey, hold on. Yeah, they're I always chewing on different things, but they love grapes, and they'll actually kneel down when they eat. They have little calluses oh, on their that. wrists. Why do they do oh, that? That's going to help them. Yeah, when they're rooting around, foraging for food. And they're also really good diggers. When they grow those tusks, they'll use those tusks to help them that dig. Is so that is so crazy how those their little front paws mm -hmm. bend oh, like that. Yeah. Well, paws, I don't know what they're called, but they're little wrists. Their little wrists bend oh, back. Really? Are, are these like uh, javelina then, kind of like we would have? Well, they're similar. Uh, yeah. They're very similar. Uh, these guys, they're going to roll around in the mud like javelina do when to the temperatures get really hot. Oh, to cool themselves. Yeah, okay. it's, they're going to take advantage of that evaporative cooling. And whenever they're cold, they're going to huddle together and use body heat. And their faces, they've got these little whiskers. You said that the tusks grow out of there, Yeah, right? so the little tusks, they have two pairs of tusks that are going to grow out of their mouth. And uh, what you're looking at is their little hair. <laughs> they have cute little uh, tufts of hair. And they have little tufts of hair at the tip of their tail, too. And if you've ever seen the Lion King when they run uh, Pumbaa's tail goes straight up in the air. Yeah, these guys do the same thing. Oh, They're like really? little flags in the oh, air. That's fun. Yeah, that is the craziest so thing to see them like eat that, like that. that. Yeah. So we can see these uh, at the zoo. Yes, you can come out to our baby animal nursery. You can see our warthogs. We have a full nursery, lots of babies on exhibit. And with these warmer temperatures, it's always nice to come out in the morning, mm -hmm. see as much mm -hmm. of the zoo as you want, and then make your way over to the aquarium. Look yes. at that with with AC. Yes, and the we have lots day. of indoor animal exhibit buildings with AC and a ton of shade trees. Yeah. So you can really still make a whole and day. And the out mornings, of it. it's still. You guys open up at what time in the morning? Now? We open at nine. Nine. Yeah. So right now, it's still really nice to be outside. Yeah. Doable for sure. Christy, okay. good seeing you. Thank you. Yes. Thank you for having us. Yes. Thanks, Wilma. Thanks, hey, Betty. Yeah. <laughs> Wilma, Betty, bring a friend, Barney, next time for sure. <laughs>